Hi folks, I am Dave, I am the man from the east, I am the one who solved Forrest Friend's treasure hunt poem. Uh, I put a video out about a week ago, uh, the end of all Forrest Friend's uh, treasure hunt solve, and uh, I tried to make sure I had everything in there that you needed to know, uh, how it all started and uh, to where it ended up, but um, I put the nine clues solved in there. And uh, I wanted everybody to know the truth of what uh, really happened. Um, as far as Jack Stoof, uh, the guy's a liar. He's a thief. I will swear 100% on that. And I'm waiting for him to uh, contact me to tell me to stop telling the truth. Uh, but it's not happening. Anyways, I don't ask you people to follow me. I don't ask for donations uh, like some of the the uh, vloggers out there I just I'm putting my information out there um, I truly am the one who solved this you don't have to believe it I know uh, my trolls they'll never see it they're just lost in space and uh, but there's a lot of people out there that video that I did put out um, there were four likes I'm, I've reached almost 500 people watching it in a week um, but there were four likes on there now, there were 18 thumbs down, 18 dislikes. So, 4 into 16 is 25%. 4 into 20, uh, 20%. I'm at 18, so I'm at what, 22.5% people gave me thumbs up. So, those are the people that I'd like to say thank you. Uh, you have vision. You saw what other people didn't see. When I started these videos, I told you about 10% of people are going to see, literally, um, the actual solve. And I, t I gave you the story how it happened uh, about Jack hearing about it and going and digging it up. And Jack is never going to give you guys a solve. I, I hate to break your hearts about that. Jack does not know anything besides what I tell him on the solve where he went and dug it up in my spot. Now, uh, like it or not, folks, I'm the guy. I am the one and eventually this will come out people will other people that are so uh, don't have vision or imagination uh, will eventually start seeing this is the actual solve and Forrest with the it was at the end of his life he's coming up on uh, 90 years old and he knew he was gonna he was gonna pass away um, he didn't want to keep going with the bullshit that that chat just imagine a guy comes in with your treasure chest and he has no idea about any of the clues and how it was solved he just shows up that's why Jack is the finder folks Jack is the finder he found where the treasure chest was by hearing about it and digging it up and you folks said that just can't get that through your head that it wasn't in Wyoming that's on you but I'm telling you right now it was in Cimarron Canyon New Mexico Forrest said he did it in in one day in an afternoon drove there and then went into the woods where he hid the treasure twice in one afternoon. And Peggy didn't even know he was gone. So I'm sh if you think he took an airplane and went up to Wyoming and then rented a car, uh, all this other stuff, you're so far off. Um, think about it. But anyways, as far as Jack, you're never going to get anything. And uh, I, I actually believe that if Toby... like. like as far as vloggers for a minute here um, some of them I just can't I can't watch uh, just it's I can't I can't do it too long too much yap about they don't they don't know what they're talking about they, they have no idea it's all guessing um, Toby had some stuff that was was good some of his videos got long but Toby Toby's a smart man if Toby really looked at my video um, and decided to make that truck to the to the blaze to the fire pit uh, he would probably realize that this is the actual solve because everything else fits Toby you were close in that Canyon you know who else I miss I miss uh, Sean Dobson good guy I tried to contact him no no response um, it is what it is a lot of people away they, they don't even want to get involved anymore but um, uh, I miss Sean uh, he had some good videos he was a good guy reasonable level-headed um, and I just wanted to put out there 
that the things you're watching on these other bloggers channels uh, you're not getting fed the right information and it's sad but it's the way it is folks unless unless you realize nobody has everything fit together like I do if you watch the end of force Ben solves video I put out there I give you everything I give you answers to every single thing and it, it yes it's my longest video I didn't even want to do it that long um, but it, it is it is what it is I, I put it out there so that you people can learn and know the truth and uh, as I said I'm at 22 and a half percent have gave me thumbs up compared to the uh, the uh, 10% that I thought people would get it anyways now I'm asking you to just follow me follow uh, follow subscribe to my channel so that we can build up some some momentum here to put Jack in his place because now I hear he's not even gonna come give the solve uh, that made up solve that he had uh, he's not gonna give it out um, because he knows it's bullshit and you folks are smarter than that come on I have my trolls, like I said, they just, they can't get it through their head. Um, they, they think Jack's a hero, they're his friend, whatever you wanna, whatever you wanna say about it. Um, but Jack is, he's a thief, man. I'm telling you right now, the guy stole someone else's saw, went and dug it up. It's that simple. And uh, he's taking credit for it. Force said it, Force told you folks, the guy, from the fiery solved it, but he's shy. Um, I'm not shy anymore. I'm let, I'm putting my information out there. I actually was, like I said, I was going to let it go last year, but I, I'm I'm not. I'm not going to give Jack the credit for solving it um, because what happens? He's he's already walking away with the treasure chest. Um, I'm not suing him. Maybe there's a lawyer out there that's going to say, "Man, you really should sue him." Um, but I'm not letting him take the credit for solving this. It's uh, it's too too great of a thing. Um, and as I said in my other videos, I'm the I'm the smartest dumbass you'll ever meet because uh, I solved it. But I let the thing get away by giving out my information to someone. If you folks don't understand that, just watch the video. I, I try to explain it in depth, but um, it's it is what it is. But follow me, follow my videos and uh, catch up on some of the others. I try to be more in depth on my earlier videos about each specific thing and how it correlates in the book and how they connect. And everything's in order, folks. You're not gonna get the T.S. Eliot from Jack. You're not gonna get the J.D. Solinger. You're not gonna get the postmarks of what they are. I give you every single thing and, and I've asked people that do watch my videos, ask me questions. But don't sit, don't try to just sit there and harass me. Just ask me a simple, question that you want to know the answer to about Forrest Fenn's um, information and what he put out there. It's it's a very simple solve, but it's complicated to how it came about there. It, this wasn't done in in two weeks, and Jack didn't do it in, in one year. I can tell you, he wandered the woods for 25 days. Come on, folks. Um, Forrest said that the area where he hid the treasure was always changing. Palisade Sill is... is always 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 changing and uh, once you folks realize what's really happened here then uh, hopefully you follow me and we can straighten all this stuff out that the, all the sh bullshit that's been said and everything else and everybody will know what really happened that's that was my goal uh, as I said I'm not trying to be an asshole and I know sometimes I get frustrated with some of the people I make Smart, smart remarks because I get a smart remark towards me. Uh, it's a self-defense mechanism. Sorry, but uh, I try to be nice to everybody. Please ask me questions. Follow me. I'm not asking for donations. I don't want them. Grew up. Uh, just judge for yourself, folks. You you have your own mind. Um, I know. Like I said, I've got 500 people that looked at that in a week. So. Now, 18 and four, 22 people responded out of 500. The rest just don't don't care. They don't give a shit, which is fine. But there are people out there who do, and you are the people I'm talking to.
So now we'll wrap this video up and uh, I hope you all have a great day. Even my little trolls, yeah. Oh, you know who I miss? Uh, uh, Love Stone. Uh, you don't contact me anymore. Uh, I know we had a few conversations, uh, but there's, I do have, I have great, some great people that, that comment and make good questions. That's all I ask. I'm trying to get my information out there. And I think I did a pretty good job on most of it. And as I said, for the people who responded, that's 22.5% compared to the 10% I thought would understand that this is the actual, factual, literal solve of Force Fan Strajanon. And uh, you folks that don't believe it, then just don't watch. Don't comment. Don't go about your day. But the people that want to know the truth, pass this along. Send it to other people. Send it to news agencies. Send it to wherever. But the the truth eventually will come out and uh, and Jack you will uh, you will be known for the type of guy that you really are so folks as I said have a good day uh, and I'll wrap this up and uh, um, give a thumbs up uh, but watch this other video uh, about the uh, solve I'll post a link on it on this uh, in the description so uh, let me know what you think I appreciate it have a great day friend be with you. <laughs> Dave, the man from the east, the true man from the east.